we can take people's rights away. A friend of mine says, nobody, um, nobody ever takes your rights away like the United States government has over drugs and marijuana. They take your, your you can search your house, things you could never do any, under any other reason, but in the name of drugs, you can break in their houses, break in their cars, you can go and do all these things. You're completely insecure. In the name of drugs, they get to be the police state they always wanted to be, but never had the excuse to get in. They had to stop something evil. They can't give up. They can't let the other guys give up, and they blackmail. If you're a congressman and your son gets, or son or daughter gets by, or your nephew, or some close associate yours gets busted, or their kid gets busted, and they can come to you and get your vote. They do. That's what it's about. That's what I believe that they've done. They've co-opted our politicians where they all have to sing this tune. A lot of those guys uh, really, really make a lot of profit on, uh, on prohibition. Uh, a lot of them. I mean, they make millions and millions and millions, ridiculous amounts of money. And I love it when we get to get exposed to that and find out, you know, because there's a lot of key players. You see the names a lot and you see them uh, getting laws made a certain way to, to benefit them from these kickbacks from companies that they own part of. Uh, and, and it just makes sense. It's like they all take care of each other up there. And, and there's a balance to that. You know, if you're a politician, there's a balance to playing that game and, and trying to get the people to like you at the same time. It's growing. It's a growing trend in this country where states are beginning to legalize this with some restrictions, of course. Restrict alcohol, you can might as well restrict marijuana too. Uh, they're all concerned about the federal government and what they may or may not do. I think eventually the federal government will back down on enforcing its federal laws.